Hi everyone, Nikki here, Smurfy161. So I'm trying to film um, some things, but as you can see, I've got this little help. Yeah, I've got to help you, Mummy. You might have to go in the kitchen. Oh no, Mummy, I don't want to go in the kitchen. Please, no, Mummy. Um, yeah, I want to do my um, crochet video and I thought this is the best way for me to do it sitting on my bedroom floor because I've reopened um sorry brain's gone reopened my Etsy shop um I've got stuff listed on there so when this video goes up you'll be able to see the link I thought I'd reopen it because I've tried selling um my handmade items on eBay and I didn't have much luck with that uh, so I thought I'd reopen my Etsy New Year give it a go um, in the States it's 20 cents per listing which I think is about like 15 PR money and it can be on there for so many months so I thought I'd try it um, yes yeah, so I'm going to show you what I've listed and what I'm working on and I'm hoping to do like crochet videos more often as well um, not me actually doing crochet, but things I'm working on, I can't do tutorials. I'm no good at explaining. I'm very dyslexic and I don't crochet the normal way. I have my own way, but it works. So I'm just going to see how we get on doing it with this little furball. He's now 18 months. I know some of you haven't seen him for a little while. But yeah, this is Charlie, if you're new to my channel. He's a toy poodle. And he's my little cutie. So let's see how we get on. If he plays up, then I'll have to put him in the kitchen. But hopefully he won't be too bad. It's just, I don't want to keep shutting him away. How can you shut this little face away? Right, so things that are on my Etsy. No, darling, you can't. Just sit next to mummy. That's a good boy. Sit there. So I'm going to try and show you as best I can. <laughs> no, Charlie. <laughs> Oh, you can see why actors say don't work with animals. <laughs> so I've done this, um, Charlie, come on. This crochet blankie. <laughs> Sorry, I'll just cover myself up for a bit. Um, so this is it folded in half. It's, what size did I put it down as? I can't remember now. But it's a granny um, crochet blanket. Um, and I've just used bright colours. So this is on there. It's a lovely little baby's blanket or child's blanket, you know, cot blanket. So that's on there. Let me just put that behind me. Um, I've also got a shawl. I love making shawls. They're my main thing. Um, yeah, so there's a link to it. I am only selling on there to the UK. But if you're outside the UK, you can always drop me a message on there. Um, and we can sort something out privately. But it was just so much hassle to try because now we've left, um, you know, we did the Brexit thing. Um, it's now more difficult to actually list stuff on there to sell to abroad. But if you're outside the UK and you want something, just drop me a message and we can sort something out. So I've also made, sorry, I keep covering myself up, but I think it's the only way I can get things in here. So I've made this shawl, loopy, I can't remember what it's, the proper name is, but it's like loopy and lacy in shades of, burgundies and plums oh actually he's been quite good because i think as long as i'm sitting down he's happy and then i finished this one off i sewed the ends in yesterday um it had been sitting out and i kept thinking i really must sew the ends in and then i've made this granny shawl and i've used lollipop um yarn i don't know if i can get it anymore because i got it from lolly's little wool shack but she's closed her um website so i don't know if i can get it anywhere else but it's really nice acrylic yarn and it's got like teals creams and brownie shades in it so yeah those are the three things i've listed i'm hoping over the next few days to get some more things listed probably not crochet because it takes a little while which if you do crochet you know but what i'm working on at the moment oh you want to sit down so you can't see me sat next to me 
bless him no this isn't for you so yeah this is the yarn that i used for that shawl but obviously in a different color yeah so it's lolly pop ball of cake so that's the yarn um these weren't complete balls she had a deal on and i can so yeah 200 grams 580 meters 100 percent acrylic but it, i know some people don't like acrylic but this is super soft so i'm making a granny crochet bag so i've done one side and it's got all these pretty blues and teals very much my sort of color so i've done one panel that's the other bit and no oh, sorry <laughs> you know what he's like my little barker and then i've just started on oh, i don't want to lose that's a good thing with crochet. If you do lose a bit, you're not hooking onto hooks. And then I've just started the next panel, and I'm just using a J hook or a six mil one, um, because I wanted it quite loopy. Um, not loopy, loose. So yeah, so I've started on that. So next week, I'm hoping to do these crochet videos weekly. So next week I will give you an update on how I'm getting on with that. Obviously I have to do a handle and line it all. So yeah, my um sort of goals and stuff. Let me bring him back in so you can have a look at him while I'm chatting. So my goals are I've got to do a crochet video every week if I can. Um, do my like card making and stuff like that. I've joined in. A collaboration i mentioned it in my other video so each month i'll be uploading a christmas make with the prompt that we've been given um so i'll be uploading that and i hope to do more videos but i want to do my crochet video at least weekly with what i'm getting on and stuff like that i've also put myself on a craft ban i'm not buying any craft stuff wool i might because obviously if i run out of wool I can't make stuff um but other than like my wool glues and cardstock i'm not buying any craft stuff to the end of march um i really want to be good and try and do that and use up some stash because i've got like part use kits and things from tonic um no i don't want to kiss thank you you look at the camera people want to see you um yeah, so those are my missions. I haven't written it down because I thought I don't really need to do that. So I hope you enjoyed this um, video. And yeah, so I've reopened my Etsy shop and I'll be putting like crochet makes on it, cards I make. Um, and every now and then I might like go into my um, scrap card and do packs of that and that sort of thing, you know, like for kiddies crafts. And I know sometimes having other people's um, card paper scraps is much more better than mine. So, yeah, those are my plans. And I will see you all soon. So take care. Say bye-bye, Charlie. Bye-bye, everybody. I've been a fairly good boy, I think. <laughs> bye, everyone.